On March 8th, 1957, Cynthia Roth Rock was born in Wilmington, Delaware to Edward and Anne uh, Markowski. Roth Rock grew up in Scranton, Pennsylvania, and at the age of 13, she started taking martial arts lessons. Roth Rock was a five times world champion in forms and weapons between 1981 and 1985. These categories are not combat oriented being displays of fluidity of movement rather than fighting and are not segregated in male and female categories but fully open to both sexes. She took first place in forms 32 times and first place in weapons 12 times in her first 38 tournaments including competing in men's forms three out of four times as there was no women's division. She was a grandmaster of five tournaments and came in first place in four out of five events. Of course, she holds seven black belts and sashes and multiple Far Eastern martial disciplines, including Tang Soo Do, Taekwondo, Eagle Claw, Wushu, Northern Shailan, and of course, Kung Fu. She received her sixth degree Black Belt in Tang Soo Do Mu, uh, Du Quan, in 2006. She was tested by Grandmaster Robert Kowalski, 9th Dan and Chair of the ITMA, and was later promoted by him to the 7th Degree Black Belt in 2011 and an 8th Degree Black Belt in 2015. She is a martial arts instructor, and her favorite weapons are the hook swords. In 1983, Rothrock was inducted into the Black Belt Magazine Hall of Fame as a female competitor of the year, she was the first woman to appear on the cover of a martial arts magazine and in 1986 co-authored a book with a George Chung titled Advanced Dynamic Kicks. In 2014, she was honored with Legacy Award at the Urban Action Showcase and Expo at HBO. In 1983, while Rothrock was on the Ernie Rees, West Coast demonstration team, she was discovered by Golden Harvest in Los Angeles, California. It was two years later that she made her first martial arts movie for them, Yes Madam, also known as Police Assassins, or In the Line of Duty Part 2, which starred Michelle Yao. It proved to be a box office success. She ended up staying in Hong Kong until 1988, doing seven films there. Possibly her first U.S. film was 24 Hours to Midnight, a Leo Fong directed film which also starred Stack Pierce. Juan Chapa and Bernie Pock, she is one of the few American actresses to enjoy stardom in action films. She had a lot of direct video features such as Chen O'Brien and of course uh, Martial Law and Fast Getaway. Though petite of stature and somewhat wooden presence on screen, Roth Rock was a formidable martial arts athlete having proven herself in the Hong Kong action market for several years before returning to films in her native country. She soon became a highly marketable figure in B action films, but found it harder to break into a sort of mainstream features that were dominated by male counterparts like uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Chuck Norris, and Jean-Claude Van Damme. Rothrock retired from acting in 2004 to open up her own martial arts studio, but the endearing popularity of her 90s era title kept her in the public eye, promoting a comeback of sorts in 2011 and beyond. Of course, uh, in 1997, she starred in the Dukes of Hazzard reunion, and she was an inspiration for the video game character Sonya Blade from Mortal Kombat franchise, and she lent her voice on the animated series one of my favorite cartoons, Eek the Cat, which was made by the producers of uh, Better Off Dead. She made an appearance in the television series Hercules Legendary Journeys playing Hera's second enforcer in the 1996 episode, Not Fade Away, while starring in the 2004 film Extreme Fighter or Sci Fighter, where she played Sally Kirk, the White Dragon. She retired from acting to teach private martial arts lessons at her martial arts studio in Studio City, California. She returned to acting in 2012 with the role in Family Santa's Summer House, and of course, she starred in action movies, Mercenaries, along with Christina Loken, Bridget Nelson, Vivier Fox, and Zoe Bell. Rothrock appeared on Ken Reed's TV Guidance Counselor podcast on March 16, 2016. Rothrock also appeared on Scott Atkins' The Art of Action, episode 12's podcast on September 1st of 2020. And she has one daughter, Skylar. 
Rothrock. And of course, if you want to know more about B uh, stars or B actors who starred in B movies or straight to video movies, you can subscribe right here on the Coconut Daddy channel and please donate to our PayPal account down there below. And you guys have a wonderful day. Who's your daddy?